Hello, this is a video on how to find measures of central tendency. Calculate the mean, median, mode, and mid-range for the following data set. So measures of central tendency, they are mean, median, mode, and mid-range. Let's find them for the data set here. And what we're going to do to find the mean, mean, and median is use Google Sheets. So we type this information into Google Sheets. Using the one variable stats tab, go ahead and clear out all of column A and then type in your data. You can type it in whatever order you please. It's not going to make a difference. Be sure you check your data input for accuracy. Putting one number in wrong can mess everything up. All right, I want the mean and the median. The mean is 68.34 and the median is 67.5. So my mean, also known as X bar, that's my sample mean notation, is 68.34. And then my median, represented by capital M, is 67.5. Now what about the mode? Well, the mode is the number that occurs the most often. If there is no number that repeats at all, then there is no mode. However, if I look at this data set, notice that 83.4 repeats twice. So the mode is actually 83.4. And then let's do a mid-range calculation. The mid-range is the minimum value plus the maximum value divided by two. So your minimum value in this case, the smallest number I see would be 47.1. And the largest number I see would be, looks like 83.4, which by the way, it looks like 83.4 actually occurred three times. So it's definitely our mode. All right, so 47.1 plus 83.4, we divide by two. And when you do that, you're going to get an answer of 65.25. So you get 65.25. And those are your four measures of central tendency for this data set. Thank you for watching.